Oh shit, what up him? What up him? What up him? Oh, sorry, sorry, I poke, I poke her in the eye. I'm so sorry, baby. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> unconditional love. Look at that. No woman is gonna give me this unconditional love. Except the dog. Look at this, she's basically worshipping me. What the freak, man? Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> she loves being spanked. Hey. Hey, Bailey. Look at that. She loves being spanked. This is my um I don't know if you can see it. This is my goldfish. Um yeah. There's only one left. My orange goldfish. I have a feeling he's gonna croak it soon. The thing with fish is that as as soon as one started croaking, the rest of the fish in the tank also start to croak. It's just funny. It's just funny like that. <laughs> as soon as one starts croaking, the rest will follow. It's as if they... Um, it's as if they are all empaths, you know? Like, <laughs> It's funny to be saying this, but I think fish are empaths. They can feel the pain of um, the creatures around them. Mighty! Come here. Bailey. Oh shit, what up? What up you? What up you? Bailey, I want you to speak. 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 <laughs> What do you think about Palestine? Bailey, I want you to speak. 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 Come on, say it. Say it. Say it. Speak. Say it. Say it, Bailey. Bailey, say it. Say it. Bailey, come on, say it. Speak. 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 Hey. Where are you going? Come here. Come back. Oi. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, I started talking to this um, this older woman um, on Tinder. She probably see this video, so I'm not gonna say too much. Um, <laughs> yeah, I, I shouldn't say too much. I, I realized um, if people wanna do some research on me, they can. Like I'm, I'm. I'm not fake at all. If you want to do some research on me, you can. And these videos are exactly just that. Um, sure, I do have some secrets, but basically what you see is what you get. Um, so I started talking to this woman on Tinder and it has never happened to me before. Some, well, when I ask for it, they usually give me their numbers but this woman was the first woman to actually give me her number without me asking um, I'm not gonna hope too much but yeah it has never happened to me before you know like sometimes it's it just 
you know, like, like when you're texting people and you know it's a chore, um, you have to work so hard to get a conversation out of these people. Uh, but she was actually the first to to actually want to talk to me, which is really strange. Um, yeah, I don't know, man. I think the modern day, the the modern day um, dating is a little bit skewed at the moment. Um, yeah, I feel like women have it so much easier than men to um, to get attention and to get people initiating conversations with them. Uh, maybe I don't have that experience because I'm not a very high tier man, you know, like I'm not a high quality man. That's why I'm not, that's why I'm not getting people's number and at attention from women and getting them to, to talk to me. Um, but yeah, I feel like dating nowadays is really skewed. And, um, it's almost as if guys have to start begging women um, to get some attention from them, to get them to to talk to them. And yeah, um, it's a shame, really. It's a shame. It should be equal. Like when someone want to talk to you and they they try to make a conversation um, and with modern dating as well like the boundaries have been blurred there's there's no clear boundaries in relationships anymore you know you could be dating a guy and then also be in an open relationship um, I'm not going to comment too much on that because there, there, there are more videos out there with people who are more eloquent than me they can talk about this topic but i think with sexual liberation comes um, a degradation and degeneration of the the family units you know there's, there's no clear structure anymore there's no husband and wife there's no family anymore. It's just, it's just an orgy, you know. What does it mean to be dating a guy? What does it mean to be seeing a guy? Like, like what? Like seeing, seeing people, you know. How how you, you hear in popular culture, people will be saying, "Oh, I'm seeing this guy." What does it mean to be seeing this guy? Are you guys a couple? Are you guys courting? Are you guys talking? What does it mean to be seeing? And 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 you know, with the rise in situationships as well, like when you consistently hang out with a woman, does it mean you guys are dating, or or does she have other options and she's just stringing you along? You know, there's, there's no exclusivity anymore. People are free to date whoever they want and people are free to date multiple people i think bumble is actually worse than tinder because you know when you let women start a conversation um, with a man they don't know how to start a conversation real talk most women don't know how to do it um there's this you know there's there's nothing to talk about when they <laughs> sorry Sorry, I sound really misogynistic, but um, I'm just sharing my observation. Why is it that when girls start a conversation, they don't know, they don't know how to start a conversation. They don't, they don't have anything interesting to open with. Um, and most women aren't funny either. It's, I don't know why. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm, maybe I'm wrong. Enlighten me if I'm wrong. Um, but yeah, I started talking to this woman and she was actually the first to be open about like um, wanting to meet up and wanting to talk, to get to know each other, you know. And maybe it's because of my pictures. Um, but as you can see, you can do researches on me. Like I, I look like this. This is a real me. I don't look flattering. This is, 
this is not my best angle, you know? Um, and I try to do the same on dating apps as well. I try to to showcase myself in this light. And people can search me up. People can do researches on me. Anyways, enough rambling. Um, it's been a long day. i got to go to sleep. Um, and hustle again tomorrow. Hope you guys are doing well. Stay strong. God bless. And... Um, I'll speak to you soon.